Hello everybody, this is Havoc and welcome to a Total War Attila, Age of Charlemagne battle. Uh, we are playing... Uh, sorry, we are playing a, a river battle. A river crossing battle to be exact. We will draw our weapons. So anyways, we're playing a 2v2. Um, our enemy has actually an ally, or a AI unit rather. Uh, simply because uh, he wanted to, and uh, we couldn't really get anyone else to join our battle. So, anyways, I'm playing as the Kingdom of the Danes. We're obviously playing as the Kingdom of Mercia, and he has Ager, or the Kingdom of Charlemagne, for both himself and his AI ally. So we will get right down to it. This is the Battle of the Loire River. We are the attackers, so we are going to have to cross. It will be quite the fun battle. This doesn't look like everyone, but I guess he is. So anyways, let's go ahead and bring our guys up. Looks like they have plenty of troops. We're going to take a look at what they have in just a second. <clears throat> Meanwhile, for me, I have Viking Hunters playing as the Danes, obviously. We have some Spearmen, which are in Pike or um, Spearwall formation. Behind them, we have some Axe Herdmen, some Heavy Axe Infantry. To the left, we have some Axemen, just regular old Axemen. And then, in the very back... We have our very glorious, very heavy melee berserkers. We got four whole units of those, and that comprises just about all of our units. We even have some house carls as our general. So we're going to have to figure out how we're going to really uh, face these troops. Let's see what they have. Looks like they have some mounted swordsmen. Wouldn't they be dismounted swordsmen? Anyways, that's what the CPU has. He has a whole bunch of swordsmen. <clears throat> which are, of course, flanked by Oblivion's own swordsmen. It looks like they have some Skola Cav, some very heavy melee. They have plenty of archers. Enemy units have returned to the battle. Uh, let's go ahead and throw in some archer, or some fire arrows. Looks like he also has some Frankish spearmen. And in the very back, some mounted swordsmen mixed in with some armored swordsmen. So this will be a pretty heavy battle. He's got some Frankish Cav, followed by the Guardsmen. So it'll be interesting to see if he moves up. He is going to move up. Okay. Let's go ahead and move up there. I'm going to keep my flank, try and hold him. He had better engage his troops fairly soon, too. <clears throat> Alright, so you know what? We're going to be in range. I'm going to go ahead and start using my heavy shot again. Mainly used uh, archer shot. My uh, <clears throat> heavy shot just for uh, the archers, the fire arrows. But we are going to switch now. We're just going to go ahead and get engaged. He better take his units in. I'm going to be kind of ticked. Here we go. Let's go ahead and get our axes into there. We need to get our berserkers ready. We are going to get flanked if we don't move in. So once we get our axemen in there, they should pretty much start causing some major damage. Who's broken and running? Oh, those guys. That's fine. Let's move back. Same with these other archers. We're going to move back, but we're actually going to... Never mind. I'm going to go after the Paladin Guardsmen if I can take out the enemy AI's general. I feel like that would be very beneficial for us.
Looks like the CPU is losing very badly, which is good for us. Uh, let's go back here. And let's focus on the enemy general. Yeah, they're getting wrecked pretty hard. Our archers over here got wrecked decently hard too, but we'll be okay without them. Sending our axe herdmen. Everyone's going to snipe after that paladin dude. CPU sitting in. I don't know if he's controlling the CPU or if uh, the enemy general is dead. That is the CPUs. So again, I don't know if the AI controls itself in these scenarios or if we control or if like he, the enemy dude, controls him. Either way, it's not going very well. We have just killed their general after all. <clears throat> Alright. He was just talking to the other guy. I was like, I didn't send my general in. Alright, so we're going to move back. There we go. Alright, so we are going to line up once again. We're just going to hit it. We're going to reform both of our lines. Let's get our Axemen back. And Oblivion is going to move in. He's going after these Royal Thegans. Alright, so I think the best way, because he's obviously not going to attack us. I mean, he has to, kind of, in the end. But, I'm actually going to let my allies come in now. Let them do some dirty work. And then once they're engaged, we're going to send in our berserkers. Where is their enemy general? Where is their general? He's back here. So we're actually going to probably go after these guys with my berserkers. So let's go ahead and bring him in. We're going to bring him in over here. These guys are pretty fast, too. They got some pretty good speed on them. I'm going to let them soak up. I'm going to let my ally soak up some troops. He hasn't really done a whole lot. I don't think any of these guys really did a lot. I'm looking. They're doing more... Archers are doing way more damage than any of the other units have. But, let's see, have we got any troops that have really done much? This guy, Axe Herdman, he's done quite a bit. Okay, so they're going to move up. This is where I actually start coming in now. I'm going to bring my Axe Herdman over here. The axes in the back. Um, no, I don't want loose spacing. I want you to go here. Go right there. You guys will soak up those troops. Spear wall, spear wall. We're going to go with our swordsmen in over here. Or axemen, sorry. Those guys are losing decisively. We're going to go ahead and go in to there. They're going to send in all their other troops. So we're going to try and flank them. May or may not work. Let's hold back. Gonna bring in these guys. Yeah. 
Here we go. Now we got us a proper battle. Let's send in my berserkers. We're not doing too shabby. Not too shabby at all. I'm gonna move these guys over here. Get this guy into the battle there. Here we go. These guys are just gonna wreck everything. Here we go. See them get into some battles. Not going to take me down very easily. I like it. I like it. We're engaging their entire front. Uh, they're moving the cav around back. Which is probably actually a pretty good move. Let's hit them in on the side. These guys are actually holding up pretty well. Dude, move your Royal Thegans in. That's fine. Go Berserk. Look at this. Oh, we're going to get wrecked. Oh, we're getting wrecked. Here's where we where we come to shine. Let's go after these guys. A couple of these guys are already berserk, so there's really nothing we can do in terms of giving them orders. But we can still fight them. So we're going to do this. He's getting up to do another round of charges. We're going to do a war cry. It gives minus five morale to a pretty wide area. And uh, kind of froze there for a second. We're frozen. We are frozen. I wonder if someone... What's going on here? It's a little bizarre. But we're not frozen. We're just really slow-mo. I think someone's internet just dropped. Sorry you had to use AI. These berserkers though, they are quite legit. Can I maintain that from afar? Is that what's going on? I think that's what it is. There's just so many units there, it's lagging. So it is unfortunate that this guy had to use AI. Um, they tend to obviously not be very good. I did set it on hard. Maybe I should have set it on like super hard. Not really sure. In terms of uh, how f the AI, I don't know if that affects AI or not. These guys are actually losing quite desperately. Let's go after these Cav. I forget that dude's berserk. He is out of control. And then finally, they bring in the Royal Horsemen. Don't really know how much good that's going to do us. We'll just hang back here for a little bit. Looks like we did lose that unit of Swordsmen. In 48 seconds, give or take a little. 
we should be able to use that melee or that morale uh, debuff again, and uh, that might that might win us the battle. Overall, we still I mean we're low, we're not at half, but. <clears throat> I enjoyed it. I'll just drop out of that. Never hurts to plug my name in there. So in case these guys ever want to play again, we'll try and meet up with them. So far, we're not doing too bad. It's just, uh... <laughs> it's just a grind. We're grinding the whole river. His whole team's routing, though, so... It shouldn't be very long. Let's see if we can't even get a few shots off at their general. Let's do the morale debuff again. And that should cause quite a few of their units to rout. Hopefully. Our units are taking them out. It's a nice charge. I don't even think I can like move into this battle. Look at that. Look at all that death. The final charge. The river is full of dead bodies. Full of them, I say. Our berserkers are insane. Looks right at He's like, hey guys. What's up? I'm just an archer. Random dudes who are just sit standing there, not doing much. There's still the ever so slight chance that we could lose this. But I don't know that we will. Uh, he's committed, the dude's committed his general. So I think we're pretty much in the clear. It's just a big, huge grind. That's all it is. That's a self, uh, self thing right there, though. Use the whip. So obviously it's not very useful for us. Doesn't look like my heavy shot's really doing anything. His horsemen are losing. There we go. Prepare for another attack. If you do another charge, odds are we could probably get through. Let's see. Let's go over there. We got these guys. Finally. I'm not even going to commit my general. We go there. We got this guy to go after those Frankish Cav. Come on. Let's keep rolling. If we can get after that general, that's all we need to do. My uh, my swordsmen, my other swordsmen have pretty much routed. Not pretty much, they have routed. Our berserkers are finally wearing down the Frankish horsemen. Even though our axe herdmen are actually not doing too great either. There we go. We can break them. Let's go after them. 19 seconds. That's when we can give some debuffs. It's pretty crazy. It's a pretty epic battle that we... Pretty epic river crossing. This looks pretty cool, though. I like it. 
There is a whole bunch of units just standing there. Majority of those are my archers. But yeah, look at that. Look at those bodies. They're everywhere. Madness. Oh, here we go. Here we go. I forgot about two, one, and Q War Cry three. There we go. All right, lads. There we go. Their general's losing decisively. Let's just get all three of these guys going after them. You're going there. See what else can we do? Our archers are routing. Why are they routing? He's leaving my flank exposed, dude. Don't do that. We're gonna bring in our house carls. Come on, this dude's losing. Let's see if we can't get him to rout. Cause that's all we need. Let's move, let's move. Before it's too late. Our men flee the field of yep. This is a shameful display. All of our guys are routing. What's up with that? Take him down. Fine, then come over to the other side. One of our archers has been lost. I'm telling you all, all of you guys, go after him. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. He is losing. Is he wavering? He's almost wavering. He's getting there. There we go. Waver, waver. I'm telling you, man. Berserkers are absolutely insane units. I recommend them for every single army. Here we go, their general. There we go. Finally. Awesome. Good game, guys. Oh, Pyrrhic victory. It was a Pyrrhic victory indeed. We will end the battle. So we lost 998. We have 802 left. Our ally, who, uh, see, Sam Lee Bezit. Okay. He employed 400 less. So he actually has less units uh, than I do. And obviously, of course, this dude, he just, he got decimated. Poor guy. But he fought hard, fought valiantly. Look at those, those mounted swordsmen getting 200 plus kills. Over on our end, our enemy troops killed Axe Herdman. They really did some damage. I'm actually surprised the Berserkers didn't do more. But, anyways, that will end the battle, so I hope you guys enjoyed it. Uh, if you did, go ahead and give it a thumbs up if you haven't already hit that subscribe button. Um, I will do more videos like this. I'm hoping to get in multiplayer. It tends to be kind of slow whenever I get on, so I will do my best to make it multiplayer. Otherwise, you'll just see some other gameplay battles. So look forward to all of those. Thank you for watching again. Follow me on Twitch, Twitter, and Facebook. This is Havoc, and I am out here. Peace.